Hey, what's up? How you doing? It's Johnny Grooms, and today I'm going to be doing a little Gunpla build, but it's going to be different. You're, normally, I do these Gunpla builds live, um, and it's a full kit, usually like a real grade or high grade kits, more high grade kits because they're a little easier and you can get them done a little faster. But today is my very first SD Gundam, and I got Burning Gundam. Try Burning Gundam. I'm gonna bring the camera down, open it up, show you what's inside, build this thing, and then I'll give you my final thoughts on the SD Gundams. Okay, here it is. Mind the, never mind the shine here, this is pretty shiny. Let's get it open. Alright, so they come with similar parts. Whole kits. They come with similar parts, just like whole kits, um, just a lot less. This is pretty much it, and everything is a lot bigger. So this should be pretty fairly easy to build. Let's get started. SD Gundam kit that I just kind of like slapped together it li literally took me like maybe 15 minutes to put together um so just you know there he is with all his stickers and stuff as you can see it's a little short and stout guy um when you want to compare it to the normal size normal size kind of Gundam's there and this little short guy um his features are a little more exaggerated but he was very sticker heavy. Everything that's blue and yellow, other than his crown here, um, is a sticker. And I really suck at putting stickers on these things. I have a hard time, they crinkle up. I never get them right. Um, you can't really tell from here, but when you look up close, you can see how it's a disaster. <laughs> a few things with these that piss me off is the shoulder hinges on the inside, they just come right out. They don't snap in. I pushed really, really hard, almost damn near broke the chest piece, trying to get that in there. But it's in there now, it won't fall It won't fall apart. So it literally will be just put up for display and left as these are meant to be. They're not really action figures. You kind of just build them, pose them, leave them standing around on a stand or a display like I have right over here. The other thing that I really didn't like is the hip joint. That thing that connects the hip to the torso, very flimsy. So when I was trying to pose it, you know, just on my table here, just to see its mobility and, and how it moves and stuff like that, it kept falling off and that was really, really aggravating in its own right. So I like this little guy. 
he was more of a pain in the neck to build than some of my high grade kits um the build speed time 15 minutes get this little guy together so if you like these little things i'll put a link in the description below where you can pick one up and yeah it's cute i like it that'll be it for today's gunpla build if you like the contents of the video like and subscribe and i will catch you on the next one later